Hi, my name is Rafael Lopez, and I'm an illustrator living in San Diego. As you can see, I'm working on a mural that I'm really excited to be part of uh, this coming June in Chicago. I love working with kids, with families, and with the community. Uh, of, of all my activities that I do as an illustrator, this is it. This is my favorite thing to do. So without further ado, I want to explain to you a little bit more about the ideas and the symbolism that went into the um, creation of this mural, and I hope you're just as excited as I am. And I look forward to seeing a lot of you uh, this coming June in Chicago. In creating community murals, I believe that the imagery should not be literal, but evoked emotions and concepts that communicate our shared community. My experience has taught me that these ideas are magnified when people of different ages, backgrounds, and life experiences participate in creating a mural, making art together at a monumental scale. Starting on the left, you see the city skyline with hands joining together. Human communications within and across cultures is symbolized by the intersection of a gestural handshake. This connection resulted in individual and collective growth as seen on the vines inside the hands. Where they overlap, there is a white area creating a focal point at the center of the abstracted historical symbols of the Y, a municipal device representing the convergence of the rivers and four six-pointed stars of the flag of Chicago. The second section shows a phoenix burr rising toward the sun symbolizing long life and reconstruction after destruction by fire, a metaphor for the rebirth of the city after the Great Chicago Fire and the city economic, social, and cultural renaissance. The middle of the mural is focused on the transformative beauty of a child spirit, the layer of faces and butterflies, and unique sense of self. Picasso said, every child is an artist. The problem is how to remain an artist once we grow up. To the right, you see the child as an enlightened adult who continues to nurture his own growth and replenish the human spirit. In the final section of the mural, you see the importance of nature urban green belts as an intrinsic part of building community. Trees, water, and sky are encircled and celebrated by men, women, and children. Places where natural and built environments are interwoven into the fabric of the city providing habitats for animals, plants, and places of reflections to replenish the human spirit. The mural naturally tapers down into the area where eventually there will be a garden.